Hello everyone, Timer over here, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play of RimWorld Beta 19. We are playing with the new scenario of Alone with Nothing, essentially. And uh, we are no longer naked, which is fantastic. We have since gotten ourselves some clothing. Um, basically from uh, the animals that have been taken out by the predators on the map. We have not yet gone hunting. And ooh, is this another? Nope, that's a uh, healthy mega sloth. We're not going to worry too much about that. Um, but yeah, we've been just searching every now and then, searching around the uh, the map for any animals that have become deceased and that we could take advantage of that. And then we use the wooden hand tailoring bench in order to uh, make us some clothing. Although it is worthwhile probably to just dismantle this at some point. but Because we didn't have power at that time. <clears throat> and now we do. Is this... Uh... No, it's just showing you, just shows a little outline of where the chair would go, which is, I guess, okay. Um, so yes, last episode we did get some um, power in our base here, and we do have an indoor freezer now, which is fantastic. And I think we can go about um, perhaps even making up a proper kitchen for right now. But I think to start with, I'm thinking of... Um, Setting up another, like an actual bedroom. Because, although this is functioning pretty well as a bedroom, um, we probably could do something about that. I don't think we're, you know, we have an awful bedroom. And it's, at this point, it's probably just because it's dirty. So he's going to have to like do something about that as soon as possible. But what we do want is an actual kitchen. And I'm thinking of... Can I move this? No. I wasn't sure because I didn't th I didn't know you could move the benches anymore. They must have put that in um, prior, like earlier. And by that I mean they must have put that in since I last stopped playing in beta 18. So that must be a new feature, which I like because of... Um, I used to use a mod that does that did that, uh, but not anymore. We're not playing with any mods this time around. Now, one notice right here I realized off camera, and I want to take care of that. We're not really hunting, so I'm going to just like reduce his that priority to a zero, so that he doesn't get you know he doesn't go hunt, but we don't get that message anymore. I only have one medicine, really. Huh. Well, all right then. Guess we're gonna need to do some uh, uh, harvesting here of things. Now, do we, are we still sick? Yes, we have gut worms. Um, which is really bad since we don't have food, and he is going to be hungry like crazy. Um. Let's go to speed three here. Yeah, see how quickly it's going down? Oh my gosh. You might have to chew, you might have to uh, cook up some food before you actually do anything when you get up here. Just let him rest all the way and get up. You needs wood. Hmm. Grumble. Go cut this down. Okay. And then. Come on. Refuel of the campfire. And cook. And then you'll be able to eat, which is going to be nice for you. So, how much meat do we have left? Hmm. Not much. I have to keep looking around for uh, another animal to bring in. I'd like to make some fine meals, but unfortunately, I don't think that's in the cards right now. There you go. Finish your meal. Should be all right. Got to harvest those. Cut this. All right. Just harvest everything. That's going to be fine. So, yeah. Where are we going to put the kitchen? Um, so, I thought about just creating a bedroom and turning this then into a kitchen area. Which, honestly, would not be a terrible idea. 
Uh, priority numero uno. Gotta go cut these trees. We need. I should just do a big um, harvest of trees here. And then afterwards, haul this wood in, and then you can refill the generator. So that our food does not actually rot away. Research. Where is, because um, I noticed that they took the solar panels out of the base tech that you have. So where where would they be? Oh, right, the water mill generator. Ooh, I forgot about that. So they did add in the water mill generator recently. And, uh, yeah, unfortunately, we don't have any, well, I don't know. Can that, can the water mill generator be placed on lakes, a lake? Does it show? Yeah, it generates on rivers, so no. Uh, and then there's the solar panel right there. So we're not, we, we could get it, but we have so much to do and like we can't devote any time to freaking research. I think in winter we'll be able to do more research based stuff. Um, because we'll be a lot less, um, we'll have a lot more need for it. We'll have a lot less time to do other things. Uh, and I try to focus more on the inside or indoor stuff as much as possible. Honestly, at this point, I wish our, um, our storyteller, uh, not Cassandra, uh, Phoebe would send us a proper <clears throat> skate pod or something at this point, because we could do another oops let's finish this we could uh, support another person here all right tell you what how about you haul viper and put him in that ground so that we don't have any issues da, 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 da. just do a little meander around here there's the there's the bear there's some now well, that's probably from an older kill This is where the allow tool mod would be really nice because I just allow everything and then right click to see if it's actually working out. Newman, what are you doing? Refueling passive cooler. I don't know if we really need the passive cooler anymore to be perfectly honest. Hmm. Uh, just, just a thought occurred to me right now. Does this thing need to be outdoors? I think it does. Doesn't say here, but just it's it's really hot in this room all of a sudden. Or is it? No, it's 32. Uh it doesn't look like this thing needs to be outdoors, so I think it's okay actually. Let's get that de uh, deconstructed for the resources. I think that's going to be okay. And then you know what afterwards I'd really like you to get some of this harvesting done. <clears throat> yeah, so we need we need some more people. I'm ready. I'm ready for it. Um, I almost want to say let's switch over to Cassandra, because things are kind of dragging, and we are in somewhat of a good shape now. When winter comes, you know we're, we're really focusing on getting our crops finished. Uh, we've got some raw food. I think we should be okay. Uh, did you actually... Yeah, you already hauled those, right? Yeah, we got four there. Harvesting cotton plant. All right. Whoa. Oh, right, because hauling is a higher priority. Can you... Why can't you sow these? 100% grown. I guess it's just not ready to be harvested, I, I suppose, is the reason there. Alright, so you're moving those in. Can I get you to clean up all this crap? As soon as you can. Please and thank you. Alright. Nothing dead? Dying? Or anything like that? Rare thrombos? Yeah, we're not going to worry too much about that. 
Ooh, we got some mufflo, but again, we don't have a ranged weapon. I don't think I'm going to try to, like, bash them in. Um, although, I don't expect to get, like, cuts or anything from um, the mufflos. But you, you never know. I think over. I think during the summer we're gonna turn this into a hallway. Build a wall out, sort of box it in like this, and then move. Uh, probably down because this is our only fertile soil nearby, uh, aside from this little patch over here. But then, oh yeah, because we, this is here, I don't think we really can do that, unfortunately. Yeah, do you still have gut worms, Newman? Yeah. Oh, this needs tended? Well, that's kind of blah. I'm going to turn that, that off. I don't want them to use the medicine for that. Uh, granted, would be nice. I don't know. I don't think if we turn the the uh, medicine off for the gut worms, I don't think it's going to mean that much of a difference. Um, hmm. It doesn't, well, you know what? Never mind. It's fine. Speaking of fine, how is your growing at this point? Plants. Not quite there yet. Where are we at? Tenth of Okay, so we got five days left of growing. We're not going to be able to get another harvest of cotton. So we should probably just turn that off or replace it with something that will grow in time. What will grow in time? Probably just rice. Yeah. Because rice is like three days. So, you know what? Just, just do rice. We got a ton, a ton of freaking um, cloth now. We're going to move our, our stockpile into this room for now. But everything that's not food can stay, can go over here. So this is going to be a bit, a bit important. Clear all foods for raw food. Um, medicine? Herbal meds. They can stay in there. Otherwise, everything else goes over here, please. Harvest botched, which is fine. We could probably take out that thing. Did you just fail to... No, that's not yet grown. All right, so he's going to take some time to move all this stuff, which I suppose is all right. I should probably, like, bulk create simple meals. I'll have to do that at some point. Structure. Where are we going to put? So, okay, bedrooms. Where do we want to put the bedrooms here? Um, I'm thinking up in this area. Either that or we, you know, we plan on the bedrooms being somewhere over here and, and deal with that. One thing I could do, since we can reinstall this, and I might try, you know, to do that, is just bring this down here and then start the actual bedroom up in this area. And I like to make my bedrooms four by four. So we're going to try to keep to that. Ooh, it's going to be a little uh, weird. What was this bedroom? Well, see, it wasn't necessarily a bedroom there. We could probably do something about that. All right, can I just right, make your make the meals? That's fine. Yeah, we could really use another person here. One more meal, and then you got to do this. Move that over there, and I don't know, go not refill. Might just have you bulk up this thing here. So do, now that we have refrigeration, let's try, let's just like go nuts and see if we can whittle our, um, our group down here. Uh, unpause at 10, I suppose. Yeah, quick and simple meal. All right, so while that's doing that, uh, let's plan out another bed or a bedroom, a proper bedroom here. And I think what I want is this. So what I might do is dismantle this door, build up a wall here. And 
either that or push out this wall back. You know what? Why don't we... Because I do want a pathway. It's going to kind of screw things up a little bit. I guess I could move it over here. Yeah, why don't we do it the other way around then? Uh, but the zones here. Whoa, heat, oh, pfft, heat wave. That is not great, actually. Not great at all. Uh, let's trim that back. And I want four by four there. Structure, boom, boom. All right, and this will be a little hallway that we start going up this way, I, I imagine, and then <clears throat> somewhat down, maybe, in the in the future. Um, all right, and then we want a door, say here. You're gonna keep doing that. That's fine. We don't really have the wood. Uh, this is gonna be a pain to keep our stuff cold. Refrigerated, 10 minutes, fluctuating. I might throw in another um, passive cooler into here just to help it sort of work <laughs> a little bit better. Oh my gosh, prioritize all in. All right, you need wood, of course. Yes, we really need some more people. Really need, oh my gosh, it's hot. Four point. Eh, it's gonna be a little rough. It's gonna be a little rough. It's okay in the bedroom. It's still the the cooler here is at least doing something. Um, and at night it does drop a little bit lower, so I think we'll be all right. Although the simple meals, and of course, just when we uh, we like build out a bunch of meals, that's when this stuff happens. So annoying. But we'll have to deal with it. All right, move away. He animals. Da, 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 da. Anything? Like to stock up some more meat. You know what? Just, just harvest, harvest it all. I, I don't care. That's gonna be fine. Are you better yet? No. That's a shame. All right, uh, get this stuff indoors before it goes bad. And how's our corn? Oh shoot! We might have to we might have to um, harvest our our crops early. Yeah, that that's not good actually. Uh, we may have to to harvest this stuff sooner rather than later. Ooh, you're running out. You're running for something. I don't know. Interesting. You're leaving the map. I don't know why you ran all the way down there. I don't know. The uh, animals, like, affected by the heat wave in any sense of the word? I don't think so. Uh, maximum comfortable temperature, 45. Well, yeah. Yeah. I mean, they're probably going to get heat stroke at some point here. Uh, do we want you to go out this way now? I don't know. What I might do is try to keep you close to home and get some and chop some wood here, uh, mainly because it's so hot out. Um, so yeah, I feel like. You're refilling, which is, you know, understandable and, you know, not too shabby. You are going over there. How much wood? No, you don't have enough. All right, come over here and just chop these trees. I'd like to get this bedroom started um, if I can and move his bed over there and then turn this into an actual kitchen, a proper kitchen, that is, and then we can get rid of that. Ooh, all this wood. Uh, then we can get rid of the campfire and don't have to start, you know, wasting wood on refilling it and everything. And in fact, I might just like 
get rid of it, nevertheless. Because we don't really need it anymore. We have enough meals right now. And we do have power, so it just requires me to um, get the... Just requires me to get the actual um, thing built. The, uh, what's it called? Oh my gosh, I'm blanking. The, the, the table. <laughs> Food table, what's it called? Oh my goodness. Uh, production, what is it? Butcher table, electric stove. That's what I'm looking for. Whew, my gosh, my, my brain just went bloop there for a second. Um, all right, can you do this? Just try to help out this situation here and you're gonna get wet and probably get a um, Yeah <laughs> debuff of soaking wet son of a gun stay inside when it's raining and keep your house clean good lord you're vomiting and Just making your bedroom into a piece of crap all right, you're finishing that up. We are going to put a flooring, just standard wood floor here. So we are going to need more wood, as always. Uh, just go out here and chop these down. All right, I want to. I want. We need to put a cut in here, but I need to. I want to finish up the bedroom and get that over uh, before we give in for now. All right, you're done. Du, 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 du. There we go. I think this will be enough. All right, get over here. Oh, 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 we forgot the door. That needs to be, make sure, um, the doorway. I don't think it really makes any difference to have the floor in the doorway, um, or at least it didn't used to, but it is nice to, to do anyway. We have a normal bed, so we are going to reinstall here. Ready, go. I can't move the passive cooler. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put the cooler over there. Uh, this crafting spot we can deconstruct. And you are... What are you doing? Oh, no. No, 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 no. How about you just do some berry cutting? We don't really need the steel at the moment. So that's going to be fine. Uh, I'd rather, honestly, I'd rather you cut plants before you actually mine so hopefully that's where you're heading now yeah harvesting poplar trees because wood right now is where where it is uh, for us all right you got that let us production i want a electric stove and i suppose we'll put it here uh no that'd be kind of silly I almost want to move the door. I like, uh, you know what? Screw it. We're just going to put it up here. That's going to be fine. Uh, electric, electric stove. And it's pretty far away. Although I plan, well, now let's put it here and we'll have a little doorway there. We'll move this thing away. <sighs> Almost, I want it kind of. <laughs> I want it in that corner. All right, we're gonna deconstruct that. It's kind of a waste of wood, granted, but it's gonna have to do. All right, so we're we're keeping things frozen, which is pretty good. We'll get rid of this passive cooler next episode. We will build the electric stove and try to set up our, um, you know, actual p cooking process and everything. Uh, oh, dirty, what dirty cooking area? Well, I don't know what to deal with that. Uh, I guess we can put cleaning up to one and then just ensure that our home zone is um, just our area of our base. Again, this is where I wish I had a cleaning area to put down. Now, there is a way to do it, but, I mean, there's a way to do it if you limit the, uh, you know, the colonists to certain areas. That's another way to do it, but unfortunately, our Newman here needs to go all over the place, so we're going to do that. But we've gone on long enough. 
Uh, we're going to go ahead and put a cut in the video. So thanks everyone for watching. I hope you're enjoying this series. If you are, let me know by hitting that like button. If you, seem, uh, if you have any comments or suggestions on what we should do, let me know in the comments below. And uh, as always, if you like the content and want to subscribe, that'd be great too. Otherwise, we will see you next time, folks. Bye-bye.